Welcome back to the Canny Tally. Um, something a bit different today, right? This is Granda's copper kettle. Now, my Granda, when he died, um, I'm trying to think how long ago, 1999, so what was that, 23, 20, come up 24 years. I always loved his copper kettle he had in his um, living room. He always filled it with his little pennies and two pences and stuff. So when I inherited this, because it's the, we're allowed to choose a piece from his house that we each wanted, um, and I chose the copper kettle. It just, I just loved it. I always fascinated when I was little. So I've always filled it with my two pences and pennies, and every now and then emptied it. Now there's only a couple of bits left in it, but it's just really junk. And other kids' pennies. Um, I've already pre-emptied that into because it was getting too much. It was so heavy because it's heavy anyway. Um, but I just thought I'd show you how cute, man. Um, so that's a new set that's inside there. So what I did is I've got these buckets from this, this soup place. I get them from work. So that is full of coins. So I'm going to mute this so it doesn't hurt your ears, okay? But I'm going to pour this out and we're going to count it. This is the bucket I've been on about in my previous videos where I keep saying I've got another bucket of pennies to sort out for the penny challenge. This is it. We're going to do it. Ta-da! Right, any guesses how much it is? Put your guesses in the comment. Unfortunately, it means you're going to have to stay at the end of the video, unless you want to cheat and skip through. But that's cheating. Who likes cheats? Come on, stay at the end of the video um, and see if you're right. Obviously, I'm going to whiz through it. I am not going to make you sit through me going one, two, three like that, because I can't count for toffee. Um, so I will fast forward it like this. Um, so see if you're right. Any guesses? Go. Now. What is that? Oh. Does anyone know if you can spend a, an Isle of Man coin? Where are we? Where's the camera? Where? Does anyone know if we can spend an Isle of Man five? Because if not, I'm going to have to change. I think you can it looks the same, doesn't it? Oh, I'll pop it in, I'm sure it'll be fine. Five pound goes in there. Oh. Put a pound in and two pences. You can get these bags from the bank and the post office and stuff. Um, I've had a stash of them for years, I don't even know where they came from. Um, they're handy just to keep a hold of and recycle and stuff. Right, I always have just weird random thoughts every now and then. Have you ever wondered, right, see all this money, how many people have held this exact coin? Like, all the people that's watching this video now, right, have any of you actually held this coin you might have done we just don't know it's just gone around the whole uk since this particular one since 2001 but this one's been going around since 1981 so before i was born so 42 years this coin's been going around how many people have your parents have your brothers and sisters has your grandparents held this particular coin we should they like, put little initials on it or something shouldn't we and see if it ever comes back to us random you know Oh my god, look at this one. Wait till I find the camera. No, it's going to focus or not. 1971. Look at my queen on there. Let's see if I can find a more modern one. In 2015, how she's changed. Well, how she did change, bless her. I love it. I might keep that one, 1971. That's got to be one of the first two pences, hasn't it? I'm going to keep that one. That's a special one. In my eyes, two, four, <laughs> six, eight, ten. Does anyone know if um, any of the coins has changed to King Charles yet? It still feels weird saying that. But uh, do you know what? By the time they even get round to changing everything that needs to change, like the money, the passports, the HMRC, the post office, the post boxes, 
you name it, whatever needs changing. <laughs> yes, sounds awful. Unless he lives to the same age as his mother, then by the time they change it, they're going to have to change it to William again. So I kind of think, is there any point? But that's not the right attitude to have, is it? But anyway, has anyone seen any coins with King Charles on yet? Because I haven't. I don't know if out yet. It's getting a little bit harder now. I'm playing hide and seek with the two pences. And I find 10 more pens. So, so nine. Come on, one more. These are probably all screaming, there it is. Come on, I don't believe this. We're like literally two pens short. How many got? 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90. Two, four, 98 pence. Do you know what? For the sake of my OCD, I'm going to take two pence out of my food budget. <laughs> there we go. Happy days. Right. Throwing these at myself. Goodness sake, get a grip. Right. There we go. So I've got to be super quick now because the school run. Pick up time. What time is it? Let me just see. Uh, ah, it's half one. He gets out at two o'clock, but if I don't go soon, I'll not get a parking space. As you know what it's like. Right. So we've got all the silver ones now. You got one in silver? Oh, right, okay. So the five pences is five pound in five pences. So we've got five pound, and then we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine in copper. So that's 14. And then we've got 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, one pound in tens. Plus, oh, I've just messed this up. Five pound plus one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine plus a pound plus ten, twenty, thirty, forty, forty five, zero point four five equals fifteen forty five. So we'll take away two pound five for the pen challenge. So some view. I zoom is in. Kind of. Move this over a little bit. So mark that one off. And then we'll minus £3.55. And then we'll minus £3.54. And we'll minus £3.53. And that leaves us with two pounds seventy eight. So we've got yes for half. There we go. Happy days. So how much did I say that was in total? I need to write this down, otherwise I'll forget. So five, six, seven, eight, uh, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, fourteen, fourteen, fifteen. 15.45 wasn't it? Right. I'll fill that in later because I really need to rush into the school run. So thank you very much for joining me. We're making a roll on this. Catch us later.